Ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba. What's the good word gang? Matt here, country song teacher. Hope you're doing well. Real fast, if you just try to get through the other six days a week so you can get to Throwback Thursday, smash the like button right now. When I say smash the like button, that's that little thumb. Every time you click it my videos, it makes YouTube shoot it out there with the algorithm. So if you want to support me, I don't even need your donation. Just my videos come on, please smash the like button. This is going to be a fun little song to play. I got the capo on the seventh fret. I did that to make the chords easy. If you're not familiar with this, you can put this capo up and down the neck of the guitar and be able to change the chords to sound just like how George Strait played it live, say on YouTube, for example, but you don't have to play the hard chords he does. Amarillo by morning, up from San Antonio. Everything that I got is just what I got on. When that sun is high in that Texas sky, I'll be booking that county fair. Amarillo by morning, Amarillo, I'll be there. So four chords you're going to play. Again, all of them relative to the slide up here. Some, all of them relative to the capo. The first one's going to be a G chord. If you've played my, watched my videos a while, you probably understand that one. Like on the two bottom strings of the third fret. Um, another little tip there, if you have smaller hands, people write me about this stuff. When you move the capo up, you can tell the strings get closer together. So if you have large hands, it might be harder. But if you have smaller hands, this might actually help you play chords that are harder. So lock on the two bottom strings of the third fret and the fifth and sixth. Amarillo by. So there's two. Amarillo by. Now for a B minor, if you can do the bar chord, great. If you're watching my videos, you either think I'm a knucklehead or you probably can't do the B minor. So do it this little trick way. Play an A minor, which is second string of the first fret, and fourth and third of the second. Slide it down to the third and fourth fret. So it's an A minor slip, up two frets. Strum four. Amarillo by morning. Now your last two chords, you're going to go back to lock in those two bottom strings. <coughs> Excuse me. The fourth and fifth is, is going to be your C chord. I call it a C. It's really a C at nine. But we do two down strums of five. And then the D chord. Keep the bottom two light, press the third string. So G, B minor, C or C at nine, D. A lot of times on that D too, I, I say keep the bottom two lock. A lot of times I'll pull my pinky finger off that bottom string. So it's just two fingers, press the third and second string. So, Amarillo by morning, up from San Antonio, G. Everything that I got, everything that, yeah, everything I got is B minor. E is C, just what I got on. When the let see, sun is high in that D Texas sky, I'll be booking that candy fair. G, Amarillo by morning, Amarillo, I'll be there. Ah, oh, yeah, gang. Good little jam there. If you want to do a throwback Thursday, you got to do George Strait. Man, I've talked. I don't know, maybe 30 or 40 George Strait. If you want to know, type in country song teacher George Strait or Matt McCoy George Strait. People will write me 50 times a day. Hey, Matt, have you taught? And I always tell them, type in my name or country song teacher and then that, that title or artist, and you'll see all the ones I've taught. Um, so there's three verses, as you know, in this song, and all three verses are the same order. To my saddle in Houston. Rodeo people, we understand that, right? Like when I wake up, all that's on my mind is the rodeo. There's girls after me, there's stuff on TV and the news, but it's just all rodeo on my mind 24-7. Where are you cowboys at? Y'all can relate to me. I mean, all I'm doing even with these videos is just buying time so I can get back in the saddle. I mean, y'all know how I roll. Country song teacher. I've got to say, like always, I was voted class clown, so... Guy in the gym said, you're pretty funny. I'm like, that's kind of what I do. I just goof off all day. That's why I stay in good spirits. So guys, if you get more advanced, you might can do the 
like where you like you pinch and pluck. Type in Matt McCoy finger picking. If you want to see lessons on that, you've heard me talk about that. great about finger picking it really helps you listen and make sure that you're studying that timing so you're just kind of you're, you're pinching and then just going back and forth with your thumb and first finger until it's time to change the chord it's time to change morning it's time to change up from San Antonio everything that go about to change I got is just what I got on and so forth so if you want to learn finger picking, like I said, type in country song teacher finger picking. I just recently did a video on that. Uh, here we go. I need to do like a little. I need to go over to my personal channel. Guys, if you haven't subscribed to my personal channel, just type in my name, Matt McCoy. I've got about 2,500 subscribers. Please go do that. Subscribe to my personal channel and follow me on Instagram. It's just country song teacher, my name. I'm always doing goofy content on there. So follow me on both of the channels, personal channel and country song teacher Instagram. I'd sure appreciate it. Make sure you smash that like button. Comment below what song we teach next, whether it's Throwback Thursday, Woman Wednesday, whatever. I'll do my very best to get on it. Love you guys. God bless you.